at my work desk while I am working on some new problem. <laughs> there are a lot of new technologies that I'd like to get abreast of. So I am starting reading up on AI and um, augmented reality and things of like that, which I'm not really finding as much time to do while running sort of four companies. But uh, I guess skills in that area would be fun to have. I wish I liked wearing formal clothes. <laughs> I hate them. This is like extremely rare for me. Typically, my general work attire is t-shirts and track pants. But uh, but if I liked wearing them, I'd probably find it, find myself you know more comfortable in many of these situations where I'm supposed to. I guess I don't know. That's random off the cuff. My greatest fear. I don't think I have a greatest fear per se, but I'm always sort of watchful of competition getting ahead of us, and so I'm always kind of like you know wary of that. I guess. I would say I've stood on the shoulders of giants. A lot of the, you know, a lot of my uh, sort of uh, personality and attitudes have been shaped by many, many biographies that I've read in my life. Uh, my favorite ones are actually recent ones are uh, Elon Musk's biography, uh, Tesla, and uh, Steve Jobs' uh, biography by Walter Isaacson. But I've read many of them, so uh, you know, I would say those two, in many ways, stand out. Inception. This book called How to Have a Beautiful Mind by Edward De Bono. Really love that. Not really. I mean, I, I think every step of the way, as I look back at my life, I mean, I think a lot of things, everything that's, that I've done and all the experiences have shaped, up, shaped me up as I am today, and I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. So, I think it's our moral obligation to make an impact on this world that's directly proportionate to our potential. That's the motto that I live by. I, I call spade a spade and, and I am not necessarily uh, a guy uh, who is uh, going to necessarily sugarcoat things to people. And Most recent achievement has been through Book a Smile. We sent a double amputee kit to, um, uh, to Canada who won the silver medal in the Pan Am Games there.